Hello YouTube fans, this is Lost Carl Clown. I am outside. Mm, it's beautiful outside, man. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Look at the way I'm dressed. I'm not even wearing a long sleeve shirt or anything like that. I'm wearing shorts and everything, man. You know? And Charles will always be like, oh, it's still getting winter. Uh-huh. Yeah, sure. Oh, why are you saying that? The planet's heating up. So, I want to talk about you guys about something. I live in Holy Lake, Massachusetts right now, obviously. <laughs> right now. <laughs> yeah, because when this thing happens, I can basically go anywhere that I want. Once, the, once these whole energies come in. And you could too. But, um, moving on with that. Um... I, you might see it with the thumbnail. I hope I can put the thumbnail. If not, then whatever. I'm, it still says it on the title. Massachusetts is technically... They, they, they have a curfew. Why? Why they have a curfew? A curfew up to 10. See, they, they, do, they don't want you... They don't want you to stay up during the, during the night time. Especially, they don't want you to go outside either. Because they know what's, go, what's up there. You know what's going up up there. Have you seen the shit that's in California? You know? The shit that's in California, they don't want you to see once it comes over here. <laughs> that, see, when, once once I heard about the curfew in Massachusetts, you know what You know what my intuition told me? That, that shit's fucking close. Close by as hell. You know? And the, the sun's right there. And sooner or later, we're going to... We're going to see these other planets, man. We're going to see it soon. You know? They can't, they can't hide this shit forever, man. That's one of the reasons, too. Um, not only that, it's because the spiritual the spirit world and the physical world are merging into one. Right? They don't want you to see while it's happening. They don't want you to see what's, what, what the birds are going to turn into. They, they don't want you to see what, what's going to happen when portals come out and shit. They don't want you to do that. You know, and there was a helicopter right above me earlier, and I was just looking at him. Then I just took in the energy of the sun right in front of that fucking helicopter, and then all of a sudden the helicopter turned around, and me and my mom were going to go to the store grab something, and it was literally, um, in a way like following us and shit. I'm like, hey, look, it's turning around, and then and my mom was like, well, I didn't do anything. And I'm like, of course you didn't. They want you to think you did something. You didn't do shit. All right? You, you, I you even told her, like, you know what happened? You, I woke up. They don't want you to wake up. The thing is, too, um, what is it? New Earth Production, he said it best. If you're not awake now, you're not going to make it. And you know what? Most people might think, well, these energies are going to wake th these people up. You're right. You're right. But I think the people that haven't awoken, once these energies come in, I literally think... That they're gonna act the way that I mentioned in my other YouTube video of saying that, um, you know, they're gonna be like, oh, how dare you woke the planet up and how dare you, um, woke me up and shit. I wanna be back to ignorancy and shit. I wanna go back to my job. I wanna go back to school. I wanna do this and that. I wanna go back watching the Kardashians. It's like, shut the fuck up, you fucking bitch. <laughs> uh, no one doesn't give a fuck about your fucking needs, all right? Seriously, all right? You think these evil beings give a fuck about our needs? No. Well, why do you think they do what they do? <laughs> you know? So, there's, there's so many shit that's happening today. Um, in any other day, to be quite honest. I don't know why I just said that. That, that came out of the blue. Huh, look at that. That might, that might say something. Um, and then, going back to what I said, just, just doesn't mean just because it doesn't happen in a physical sense, doesn't mean in the spiritual sense it, it did happen. Because we all know that this shit is changing. And we all know that the planet's heating up for the better. The Hokonalini is rising. And so are we. You know? There's a video I do want to make. I might have to put it in my new, well, my Nintendo channel. But I was going to do a video of showing what happened to us in ancient times. In those two clips I want to show you from Dragon Quest XI and from um, Avatar, the movie. And yes, it's about the tower, the tower, the tree tower falling down. Yes, I want to show you guys that. 
um, those of you that, you know, just, just give the, you know, for other people to see also to, to be like, oh my God, this is what happened to us. I'm like, yes, they tell you this in these movies and games, but no one doesn't want to fucking listen, you know? So, and these motherfuckers, man, like, I remember when I was going outside earlier too, um, well, yesterday at night, I, I keep seeing these helicopters too, flying around and crap, and I'm just like, you guys are stupid. It's over for you guys. It's literally over. And once it is over, that's it. You can't, you, they can't come back. They can't, they can't, um, they can't do what they want to do anymore. And you see this right here? This uh, mini tower that I made. So I don't know if you can see that, but I made that. But, um, this, there's other things that there's other things that these evil beings don't want you to know either. Obviously, because once these energies are coming in, it, it's going to be a crazy time. It really is. It really freaking is, man. So, um, I'll be right back real quick. I want to pause and walk around a bit, but uh, find a place that I can like you know chill and relax and talk to you more about. The shit that I'm witnessing right now. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm outside. It's so fucking beautiful outside today, people. Man, like if you haven't had, if you haven't had the opportunity to go outside just because you're scared of this, all of this shit that's happening, man, I feel sorry for you because. You're not getting in these light codes, basically. I mean, in a way, you are because it goes through people's houses, anyways. It's it's the energy, you know. So, um, I'm just trying to find a place to sit and shit, so I can. I think that's that's a good spot, but I usually go to the you know the uh, nice, comfortable spot that I used to go to. You guys have seen me do videos on there. Um, not the, not the playground place, the, not the, um, baseball field, uh, basically I'm, like, right across from it, so, <laughs> we'll, we'll get there, uh, so, you know what, since, 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 you know, I am talking and walking, might as, fuck okay, I'm going to here, might as well mention that, um, People are already telling me, oh, Biden's gonna win. Biden's gonna win. Oh. And I'm just like, I don't care. I really don't give a fuck. Alright? Because at the end of the day, who won? We did. We won. Alright? And these evil beings don't wanna tell nobody that. They're salty. They are, they're salty. So. Sorry about that noise. But, um, it happens when you're walking outside and shit. But, um,. You know, this is a good time to, you know, I, I went back to the store today. I got a few stuff, got another jug of water, you know, because that's the most important thing too, uh, water. Not just food, water. But, uh, you know, I'm confident. Oh, I can't be here, huh? Fuck. But um, I wonder why. But, um, sooner or later, um, well, I'm just going to say, Good thing that I ordered that, um, that, uh, what is it, the stove, good thing I ordered that stove, and the, the thing, uh, what is it, the, the cart, the big giant, the gas thing, comes in today, I, I bought like a stack of them, so it comes in today in, in the mail, so I'm look, really looking forward for that, because um, I thought it was going to come in the mail, the, the stove today. But no, it's coming out on November 9th, so I don't I don't know. So um same thing with the Adams Family game that I bought. <laughs> no, I haven't definitely 100 percent beat it, but I've gotten far enough that I know I can beat it, you know. But uh, I might do a video on that on my other channel, but hey, I can't since I can't make videos on that channel right now. Um and I don't know if I'm gonna leave that channel just abandoned now because if I get one more strike on that channel that's it it's gone forever which which sucks it's fucking it fucking sucks no I'm gonna stay here fuck it no one's not around right in front of the sun here perfect beautiful sexy <laughs> so you know what 
you know, I was going to take off my shoes here, but there's some shit here that I, I don't trust. So I'm not going to take my shoes off here. I'll take my shoes off somewhere else. But um, this is great. I this, this stuff that's happening right now is great. For real, man. Hold on for a minute. I'm trying to light this blunt, but the wind is blowing it. <laughs> so, um, might have to move away out of the sun, sadly. But, um, one thing before I pause in and light this blunt. There's a lot of people with this whole election shit, and it's just, it's, it's just sad. It's just really sad because a lot of people around here don't realize what the fuck's really happening, and they want you to pay attention to our fucking election. And yet, Nothing didn't happen on the third. Oh, it might, and people are literally making videos joking about it, saying that, oh, you know, um, the election is going to happen in, you know, this whole month, all week. And it's just like, was it supposed to be, oh, I don't know, a fucking day? Oh, but now they can't decide, right? Can't decide? Oh, but all of a sudden now Biden is in the lead. All of a sudden. I don't give a fuck about both of them, man. I've, I've said this countless times and in videos and if anyone thinks i'm up for trump or biden something's wrong with you man i'm up for none of them all right and then when you tell people that automatically they look at you as an enemy and i'm like go fuck yourself you bitch you know what you know what fine you might look at me that way as an enemy but when this battle happens how about now you gonna look at me as an enemy then no you won't because you know i'll kick your ass and kill you <laughs> all right so don't fuck with me man this is the shit that's going to happen. We're going to have to fight some of our people, which is sad. We might even have to fight, fight, quote unquote, some of our family members, which they're not. They're like here to, they're just here so we can experience them as family members. Some of our family members or friends, they're not even, we're not even supposed to hang out with them or be with them, you know? Um, in a way we do because we, we grow with them sometimes and we grow spiritually and shit. So it depends who the person is, you know? Um, like, um, D. Cantz, um, 21, his family is, like, reptilian and shit. They're Dracos. And I'm just like, that's fucking crazy. Imagine being born with a Draco family. And you, you actually see this fucking shit and they, they don't want, you know. Because there's certain types of, they might not know they're Dracos, but he can see that they're Dracos. You know? Because most people be like, oh, that's bullshit. How can you not see this and that? I mean, how can you not see them as, like, I mean, how can you... How could they not know they're not Dracos? It's because of their soul. Their soul. You know? And most people are like, Dracos don't... Some of them don't even have souls. You're right. So, they're, they're spirits. They're spirit. You know? Especially if they're trying to drain your ass. And the thing is, you don't have to be a reptile to drain people. You're using that Draco mindset to drain people. You know? So, that's just an example. Um, because believe it or not, I know some family members that are literally like Dracos. They like to suck people dry, man. Not with money, but their fucking energy, their time and energy, basically, where, where they could have just used that for themselves, you know, or probably learn something. Just saying, man. Just saying, this shit's fucked up here, man. Really fucked up. But uh, I'm gonna pause the video again. Sorry, I kept pausing. No, I'm pausing, but you know, I'm trying to find a nice place to sit, a nice place to smoke. But uh, you know, find a perfect area with barely wind, good sun, and nice sitting. <laughs> That's nowhere to be found, man. <laughs> uh, look at that shit. You see that? Look at that chemtrail. Look at that. Look at that. Oops. And yet, we're the crazy ones, right? Why, question, why are they chemtrailing next to the sun? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Because I was going to make a video about that shit yesterday because I literally saw them. Literally, there was a chemtrail that was going like this, and then all of a sudden it turns where the sun is at. And I'm just like, you. Come on, man. Like, you guys are fucking like, come on. Like, come on. <laughs> <laughs> like fucking for real man like they, they want us to be they, they, they want us to you know have a curfew around 10 but are they having curfews 
That's what I thought. I have to do it around here. Sorry, guys. Sorry, I had to turn my back and show you. I was trying to like this. So, hey, little spider. The spider just gave. It's like a black spider. Little tiny one. So, this spider was literally trying to call. call. I'll see you later. That's cool. That spider just used his web to like jump and shit like Spider Man. I'm like, that's dope. Almost like a jumping spider, but jumping spiders are different. They literally use their legs. But that spider, it literally jumped, but used its web, basically. Like, it connected and then jumped. You know? That's pretty dope. Damn. This is Kadoo. But, uh... So, guys. I want you guys to know that... That, um, <coughs> that when I don't know if this is happening in your neighborhood, but they they're making curfews now, right? And that's telling you that they don't want you to see what's around you, man. They don't want you to. They don't want you to. That's the thing. You want us to stay inside, but what if we start meditating? Oh, that's too much, right? Shout out to Remedy H because he showed a picture in his um community page that um YouTube community page that um they sending bricks they they setting up bricks for like a, a riot to happen and shit and um and um Remedy H is like not in my fucking town and shit and I'm just like right exactly if I saw that shit I would have been like what well, I would have been upset I need to like this shit again probably. So, if this is happening in your neighborhood, tell me, because we're having curfews now. <coughs> what are we, for? What are we, like, eight going to preschool and shit? Seriously. Like, what are we? I'm looking at that spider too. But, come on, people. <coughs> they don't want you to wake up. You know? And the thing is, a lot of people might. I'm going to ask this right now, but I want to say this. Some of my family members are like, I don't care if Biden's a pedophile as long as Trump is not president. That's a sad case. You know what's going to happen to you? You, ooh, man. That's how you know you're not going to make it out of this matrix, man. That's how I, that, that's how I know. That's how I know. I don't know why it glitched up there. You saw that? It's about to end soon. Look at that. But, um, I'll see you guys later. Be safe. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And just tell me if this is happening. If this is not happening in your place, but it probably will happen everywhere. So... I'll see you guys.